delicious as always. Alright, now that the old stomach's full, it's time to put my muscles to work. Raphael, do you have a minute? Oh, hey, Ignatz. I've got hours for you. What do you need? Well, um... How would you feel about joining me? As a knight, I mean. Me? Be a knight with you? Yes. That's why you joined the academy, right? But all the roadblocks in your way have made you almost a mercenary at this point. As you know, I've been working as a knight under House Gloucester for a while now. And it seems I'm going to be rewarded rather well when this war is over, for all my achievements in helping the effort. I might even be able to use that newfound sway to recommend you for a position of your own, Raphael. Hmm. Well, what do you think? It seems like a good plan to me. Is that really what you want, Ignatz? Huh? What do you mean? Don't pretend like you don't know. We're friends, remember? I can tell in a flash when you're not being honest with me. Well, I... I couldn't possibly spend all that reward money on my own, so... That's not what I'm talking about. You're not happy staying as a knight, and you know it. <sighs> you really do see straight through me, Raphael. Honestly, I've wanted to make amends with you this whole time. Your parents died in my parents' stead, after all. I thought the least I could do was help you become a knight, like you always wanted. Thanks, Ignatz. It makes me real happy to hear you say that. But you don't need to make anything up to me. And you definitely shouldn't be basing your life decisions on it. You got where you are with your own strength, right? You should be using that for what you want, not what you think anyone else does. Raphael. And you know, I'm totally okay not being a knight. Once this war is finally over, and we're at peace again, I'm gonna take over the inn. So don't worry about me, okay? Follow your own dreams, Ignatz. I'm really no match for you, Raphael. But I'm proud to call you a friend. From the bottom of my heart. <laughs>